now motivation session number six. Alright guys, so I just want to address something that people tell me all the time or ask me all the time. They ask me stuff like, Jiggy, how do you stay so motivated all the time? Or they say stuff like, Jiggy, you're always so motivated. The truth is, I'm not. I don't know about anybody else, but me, I'm not bionic. I am human. You think you're tough, but you're still a baby. Just like you, I would just rather stay in bed and sleep. There are days when I don't want to go to the gym, I don't want to make videos, I don't want to do podcasts, I don't want to go to work, I don't want to go to classes. And me personally, it takes a lot out of me to want to get out of bed and do something and start my day. And especially for this year of 2017, I'm really trying to make it a goal for myself to just do it and stop waiting. Like this YouTube channel, I've always wanted to have a YouTube channel, but I always made excuses like I need the right equipment, I need better quality camera, I need the right lighting, I need to have certain ideas first before I ever get this thing started. Fun fact, I never wanted freestyle motivation to be this way. I never wanted to be the one holding the camera. I never wanted to do it in the hallway of my apartment. I actually had this whole idea of wanting it to make it look like a rap video. I wanted to hire somebody. I wanted to be really serious and not very funny. But then one day a friend came up to me and he was like, Jiggy, you need to start a YouTube channel. And so I started the next day and freestyle motivation is what it is now. And I love it. I also just launched my website, which I've been working on it ever since May and then I kept wanting it to look perfect and more perfect and I wanted to be really detailed and then a friend of mine who I was talking to about started his website too but he started working on his website after me but then launched it before I ever did and honestly if it wasn't for him I don't think my website would be launched right now so as much as I tell you guys to always consider your emotions sometimes well most of the time when it comes to goals when it comes to doing something and getting it done you have to put your feelings aside and you just got to do it so January of the new year is already about to be over. To all you new year, new me people, I hope you accomplished your daily goals. I hope you accomplished your weekly goals. I hope you can review January and acknowledge yourself for how far you've come. And for February right around the corner, hope you have some really good goals that you'll be able to accomplish. Growth doesn't happen from being comfortable. Welcome challenges. Be challenged, be pushed. If you still don't know how to be motivated, if you don't really have the support system, if you don't have people in your life who are able to push you, there are always outside resources. Whether that's me, whether that's Eric Thomas, whether that's just random motivational videos on YouTube, find a source of motivation.